My name is Donald John. I'm the member of the Friends of New Milledam Country Park, which is a group of volunteers that meet every Tuesday. The project is to create a five to six hundred meter circular path to bring people into this area of the country park, which is a very attractive valley. First of all, it needed to cope with the very wet conditions that we encounter on the site. It's a very wet area and one which obviously demanded a special kind of material. We needed something that was as maintenance free as possible and anti-slip rather than the wooden type of boardwalk which gets very, very dangerous underfoot. It's proved to be relatively easy. We've become quite uh, adept at uh, the manner in which we uh, use the material on site. We've been able to bend and manipulate the material quite successfully so far, partly down to the simple fact that it is plastic. Quite frankly, all, most of us are quite uh, novices, if you like, at this kind of exercise. Obviously, we're very fortunate. We've got a few people who uh, join us and that kind of thing. But most people could probably tackle this with an ounce of uh, DIY skills. With the exception of the auger, which is the main piece of kit that we use for drilling the holes, yes, everything else is fairly standard stuff. I wouldn't say anything's particularly special that you cannot pick up at any DIY store. The earlier part of the boardwalk has been down now five years and there's no evidence whatsoever of any deterioration. You know, it has got the longevity that traditional wooden boardwalks don't provide and we've been very pleased with the lack of maintenance that has been associated with it. Once down, with the odd occasion of putting a replacement screw in, that's the only maintenance that we've had to do throughout that period of time. You know, in all possible respects, we've been pleased with the material, both in terms of its uh, uh, flexibility, its uh, potential for lack of maintenance and also its appearance because its appearance looks very much like uh, traditional timber and we've had many many very positive comments over the last few years following its installation. <laughs>